this is an example of an engine and transmission and a rear end that will be resold. At Bill Fazekas' auto wrecking yard, we sell used parts. 90% of the cars on the Olympia lot were purchased from owners looking to get rid of their old cars as a way to make quick and easy cash. It can vary from, uh, we'll remove it for free to I'll pay you $1,000. Cash. Cash. But that could be changing because of a new law aimed at stopping catalytic converter thieves. The car parts contain precious metals and can be easily removed and sold for cash. So legislators pass a law that prohibits the sale of the converters for cash. All transactions must be done by check three days after the sale. The bill passed out of the House and Senate unanimously. The first form of defense to remove an incentive, Mr. President, is to remove that lure. Cash. No cash the same day. It will reduce our ability to, to be in business. No doubt. No doubt. Zika says since most of the cars he buys comes with their catalytic converters, he's afraid to keep to paying for them with cash when the new law goes into effect this July. He worries he'll lose customers eager for cash who won't want to wait that three days to get paid after he's taken their cars away. We're not a trusting society. <laughs> That senator you heard from said he does not think auto wreckers will be impacted by this. He says if the law does need to be clarified, though, he is willing to re-examine it when lawmakers return here to Olympia next January. Live in Olympia, Drew Mickelson, King 5 News.